Okay, so with this video, I have three cylinder vases that I got from the family the, uh, Dollar Tree, my local Dollar Tree. And I have this stained glass paint by Krylon. I purchased this from Amazon, and I'm going to give this, uh, this set a tinted glass look. I have some Gorilla Clear Grip Glue, and I have these pearls that I also got from my local Dollar Tree a couple years ago and I'm going to use my alcohol and my paper towel just to clean my vases. You want to make sure that your surface is, is really clean before you use any kind of glue. So I'm going to clean off my vase real good. And I'm mainly doing one side right now because this is the side that I will be gluing them together on. And then once this once it's dry, then I'll go ahead and finish cleaning the whole base before I begin to paint it. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take my Gorilla Glue and I'm just going to start by putting the glue on each cylinder base on the side and I'll be gluing them together. And I'll be completing the same process with the other cylinder vase. Okay, so now that this is dry, 
um, and it's pretty much ready for decoration. I'm going to use these gold ice gems. They got they came from Amazon, and um, they have them in all different colors. They also have silver, but with this one, I'm just gonna I'm gonna use gold, and I'm gonna use some Gorilla Hot glue sticks. And I'm going to use this gold chain that I got from my local Dollar Tree. It's not the exact same gold. Well, pretty much it is. But I have another one that um, is gold also. And this is more of like a, like an orange or a copper. So you can see the difference on that. So I'm going to, I'm going to use the gold, gold, yellow gold. So I'm going to start by um, taking my hot glue. Well, I'm going to wipe this off first because it's just a little dusty. And I'm going to just lay it down. And I'm going to take my gold chain. I'm going to cut it. Then I'm going to place it in the crease on each side. I'm just going to take my hot glue and I'm going to go down the crease Using hot glue, you will see some glue strings, and all you have to do is just pull them apart, and if they're kind of hard to come off, you can just wet a paper towel with some alcohol, and it'll take it right off. So I will do the cleaning up after I finish the other side. I'm going to repeat the same side, the other side with the same process, and then I'll be back to show you how I'm going to add my gold ice gems. Okay, so now that the um, the gold beads are dry, I'm going to start by just taking my gold gems and I'm just going to place them along the, close to the gold beads as I can get it. It's not going to cover it. It might seem like I'm covering it, but I wanted to put the gold beads there just to cover that seam. So 
I'm just going to place, place them one by one. And it's really not just going to be a certain kind of design. I'm just placing them um, just because it's gold and a lot of people are doing silver these days and I'm not seeing much gold. So I decided to try something with gold this time just to see how it turns out. So if you do try this project, then of course you can make it any color that you want. I'll be back real soon with another tutorial that I thought of. And I hope it be just as pretty as this one. So as you see, I'm really not making a certain pattern. I'm just applying the gold gems on just to give the base a look. And again, you can use any color that you want. You can use um, pearls. They have flat back pearls that will be pretty with this project as well. Um, I'm not going to take this all the way up. You have a choice. If you want to take it all the way up on this tall one, you can, but I'm not. So as you see, I just did this part right here, and I'm going to complete the same process on this side. And then I'll be back with a finished look. And here's the finished look. I just placed these flowers on the inside. Don't really have... Um, that many to choose from but you can also use gel beads just fill them to the top and maybe place some floating candles on the top of them